Some call uh, this, his house in Opryland the Opryland of the neighborhood, I should say. I'll get that right. Tonight's Ann Chapman Holiday Lights Contest finalist is Tim Roberts. He shows us what goes into keeping his home so bright. Every bush all the way around the house. Maybe Tim might not have thought it needed to go all the way around the house. Every gutter all the way around the house. I thought it needed to, to so everyone in every angle could see it. Uh, do something new every year. You cannot buy that star anywhere. I built that from an old tripod from a telescope with a curtain rod. If you put too many lights together in a row, it'll blow a circuit, so you have to be careful. So I put in, under the house, I ran a circuit just for Christmas lights. I've got three totes of lights just for the bushes, another tote for the gutter lights. Thousands of lights I have around my house right now. I couldn't even begin to think. <laughs> In the corner lot that we have, the side street is about eight to 10 feet higher than the house. You are looking down at our yard. The house being on the corner, we had to do all the way around the house to make it look right. It's just a beautiful scene that you can see and look out over the house. You can see all the lights from up there. And our neighbors that set up higher, they tell us all the time, they, they, we can't wait for your Christmas lights to come on. And they, they do, they, they enjoy sitting at the windows and watching them too. We drive it, we park it, we sit there and look. We're not ashamed to say we like to look at it too. I do something new every year, something new and different. I like to look good from every angle. I looked at them and I said, well that one's not tight enough, you need to stretch those a little tighter. <laughs> <What happened? laughs> yeah, I guess that would be true. I do I, stu I do send him back up there a few times. <laughs> she said fix and I fixed. <laughs> I don't mind going on the roof, I think it's kind of fun. The Christmas light repair box. This box has seen several years and you can tell it, it is worn. Everybody needs one of these little tools. You can check your fuse up here at the top. You can check your lights. The tool is necessary. Small pair of needle nose pliers. You don't want to hurt your hand pulling the bulbs out. All my lights and all are in my kit. So that's my box. We're not out of control yet. <laughs> the whole yard won't be the Griswolds. It just looks traditional. It's festive. And my electric bill just spins and spins and spins. But for one month, that's OK. It's the Opera Lane Hotel of Donaldson. People come by and tell me that it looks just like Opera Lane Hotel. That's a compliment.